Zoom has been the most popular virtual meetings and virtual webinars of choice for many years. But what if there's a better alternative for creators and small business owners like you and like me? Hey, it's Faye, and in the past few years here on YouTube, I have shared some of the more popular videos and tutorials related to Zoom meetings and Zoom webinars, but I think it's time for us to take a look at other alternatives. So in this video, I want to talk to you about Be Virtual. I wish I've discovered this platform a long time ago, but, but it has only been around since 2020, and many of you haven't heard of this. With Be Virtual, you can customize and brand your virtual meeting and webinars. You can easily create call to actions. We're talking about like a single button or multiple buttons. You can choose to hide and show it at any time. You can pre-plan and pre-build these buttons so they're always ready to go for your virtual meetings and webinars. The trippiest thing is that you can also share a website with your attendees and they can just like you browse the website, even scroll up and down on the page as well as filling out forms. This is because Be Virtual is designed for creators and micro entrepreneurs like us. It's time for us to leverage our time, our virtual meetings and webinars to drive real sales and business impact. When I first discovered Be Virtual, I was a little skeptical because it just felt like it's too good to be true. Yet the video audio quality was really high and I got to connect with other creators and micro entrepreneurs just like myself, see how they use it, see how they integrate the tool into their day to day. You probably guessed it. You can start with a free version. It's also called Be Free and it gives you a lot of bells and whistles you can start testing out right away. I've included a link on the screen right now and also in the description below. If you want to explore, there's no credit card needed. With a free version, unlike Zoom's free account, you have up to 90 minutes instead of 45 minutes for meeting durations. You can stream up to five different platforms. You can also join groups and shows and other webinars as part of the Be Connected platform. Their next level up is called Pro Membership. With Be Virtual Pro, you now have unlimited meetings, unlimited durations. You can create custom meeting and webinar branding, create call to actions during their meetings, or sometimes they call it shows. Finally, there's the platinum membership and this part is crazy because so for $49.95 which is $49.95 you can now host webinars for up to 3,000 attendees. Hear me out for 3,000 people if you need to subscribe to the equivalent Zoom webinar account you need to spend $990 per month. However, if you choose to experiment with Be Virtual, the webinar will cost you less than $50 each month. And you'll have up to 100 gigabytes for storage. That alone can cost quite a bit with Zoom webinars these days. So let me go ahead and quickly show you on the screen right now how to sign up for Be Virtual and how to get started with your first meeting. Hey guys, so to get started and sign up for Be Connected, visit fay.beconnected.com. From here, you can click on sign up. And then here, this is where you fill out your information. Like so, create a password, agree to the terms and conditions, and hit continue. Once you have created an account, just click on login. And from here, you can actually book this page or you can bookmark fay.beconnected.com and then simply click on sign in. As you can see, I've already saved my information. I'm going to click on log in. Upon initial login, this is your profile and you can for now ignore B feed, which is their news feed and simply go to B virtual right here. You don't have to customize anything. You can just get started right away. Notice that you have two links. One is for your regular meetings and the other is for webinars. They're a little bit similar to be honest, but the webinars will actually allow you to create really large meetings. So to get started, why don't we just start with meetings? And all you have to do is open up a new tab. Remember, everything's through the browser and you can customize this username here. For me, I just keep it simple like fay.beconnected.com. If you prefer a different name, you can always scroll down and change that to something you like and can remember. Now, once that's done and let's just log right in. From here, you can see that I've already customized my page. I'm going to show you in a second how to do that. And from here, I'm going to say log in as admin. Remember to give permissions to your camera and microphone to be connected to be virtual. Why don't we also take a moment to show you briefly how to personalize and customize your meeting. It's really straightforward. You do not need to be a computer programmer or professional designer to get started. I have just updated my background image and look, it's already been updated like so. So when I log in as a, um, as a host, 
I do notice that some of these updates would take a moment, like five minutes or so to be reflected. And here I am, join with the video. Here I am, you can still see a little bit of a background there, but here's my purple, new purple background. Let me go ahead and show you something else. Let me go, go ahead and click on end and exit. I wanna show you my webinar link now. So honestly, exact same thing, really easy to remember. This is gonna be a webinar. Look at my webinar page. So much more happening here, why? Let me show you. So under webinar configurations, uh, you can use webinar configuration for top image. You can have a middle image. You can also have a bottom image. So I have even more call to actions I can create. Again, guys, I'm not completely sold on this particular image or this color for the call to action. This is more for demonstration only. So I have my checkout, be virtual. So that's my affiliate link or any link of my choice. I have best AI tools people can check out as I'm talking about AI to my audience, as well as full stack content marketing, free webinar. So if you want to, you know, have really interesting backgrounds or imagery or color or color palettes to choose from, I'm also going to let you know that I love using Adobe Express. I've included a link in the description below. You can get started with Adobe Express completely free of charge. Together, you can really combine different tools to customize and really leave an impression for whoever's joining your meeting. Imagine most people are still inside Zoom meetings and webinars with the black bars and screens with no personality. Anytime you're trying to share your screen, you almost have to apologize ahead of time. Hey guys, I'm going to share my screen in a second and it takes over and moves everything around and your participants and attendees don't really have any ability to interact with you at the same time. I got to say, Be Virtual really solves for that. I'm so excited to explore Be Virtual because I feel like that's really the meeting and webinar tool of the next generation. You can freely play videos with the sound on or off. Everything is natively integrated and embedded as part of your meeting. You don't feel like you're constantly being interrupted or losing control as a moderator or as a host. At this point, you may be wondering, what are some of the downsides of Be Virtual? Well, first of all, it is a new tool. So for you as a host and moderator, this is something you have to learn. And that's why when providing these tutorials to really expose other people to tools beyond just Zoom. Good news is that learning curve is not very steep. And on top of that, when you join the community, when you join the platform, you're going to find other peers and people just like you to help you get started. That is optional. If you prefer working with a mentor, with a peer, it is available to you. Now, what about people who are attending or participating in your events? Of course, as exciting as a new tool is, sometimes you have to explain yourself. You may have to answer questions in terms of why it looks so cool, they are different colors, unlike your previous meetings before. Rest assured, for your attendees, joining the meeting is really straightforward. They will have it a direct link to your meeting or webinar. You can also provide passwords if that's your choice as well. Lastly, great power comes great responsibilities. It's true. With call to actions and so many strategies and different bells and whistles you now have access to, you have to be careful and make sure that you design and plan your meetings accordingly. Just because those call to actions, even pop-up screens, are finally ready for you to really tap into it, it doesn't mean that you just plaster all these buttons and call to actions all over your meeting. So in my next tutorial, I'm going to walk you through not only how to personalize, customize, but also how you can take advantage of such a powerful tool and make sure that you sell strategically without interrupting the flow or the value of the work you put forward. So make sure that you use these buttons sparingly, strategically. And if you like this video, please continue watching this one right here. And if you enjoy Be Virtual, please let me know in the comments below anything else you would like to learn because I would love to share more with you. So much gratitude to this community and happy holidays and see you back here very soon.